Hello Malaysia, this is Jericho here and this is a wait a minute production. Today is the, oh, the 13th of uh, September 2013. It's a Friday so it's only after uh, let's say it's uh, 2 o'clock, almost 10 minutes to 2 and the shop closes at 2 o'clock. So there are three adults here, we're ordering only for like two, two portions of uh, Baku Day. It will be half and half, that means uh, lean meat will be half and fat meat will be the other half. Uh, it's best when you're eating Baku Day to have half half because you just have, if you're very health conscious and uh, you just only have the lean meat, it wouldn't taste as good as having the fat. The fat is where the, the taste is. So uh, many times already I come here, this will be the second or third time that I came to like eat here and uh, do a video as well. So Asam Bakude, this one is in uh, SS2, SS3 area near the Indian temple or near the site where it used to be the Motorola but now it's been developed as a, well, as a, as a condominium stuff and stuff. No, I'm sending. So you got wow, so boiling hot and there's the mushroom. I think shiitake mushroom, isn't it? Do you want more? You want garlic? You want garlic? Baku there is uh, originated from Klang, isn't it? From Klang. 
There are many types of uh, paku there. Uh, this one is the herbal type. Uh, there's also some kind of uh, uh, very 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 light colored soup type. This one is a brown brown colored soup. The the light colored soup is uh, I think it's mostly very simple. It's just a garlic base and soy sauce. You know, I'm not mistaken. I haven't tasted it before, but hopefully one day I will get to taste it. But, uh, oh, this is just a lean meat. And uh, without the fat, it does not taste sweet. But we have to eat this type of meat with the soup. The soup tastes sweet. Condiments of the chili padi and uh, the garlic here. Uh, it's, a, it's a great compliment, but don't eat too much of this uh, garlic because it's uh, very. The taste is very, very, very pungent, very strong. It can uh, overpower the bakut there. Normally there should be some uh, black, black thick sauce, uh, black, non, non, uh, not sweet, not. So we have black pig soy sauce. That one is more towards the Hokkien side. Uh, yeah, they have it somewhere. Thank you. Which is this one? This one's the thick sauce. You can uh, put it with your garlic or your ginger and whatnot. So they can put extra soup on, onto it, which is a added bonus. Let me reiterate on what I said just now. The, the thick black sauce, which is this one here, is actually slightly sweet. So it's good with uh, lean meat, which is uh, not so sweet at all. Uh, you put this one with the, the black thick sauce and it becomes sweeter. So it's a nice way of eating it. Normally this part of there is for like say when you're in clan, you eat this for breakfast even though it's very heavy, it's meat based and it's also rice. But uh, back in the old days when this uh, this this uh, meal was made it was actually catered for the opium uh, fellows who like in Klang that is. Not the old Klang road here, but in Klang which is around 50 kilometers away from Slango or from uh, from KL. So it's a food for the opium fellows.
to create this good very good uh, have you ever tried the other type of uh, baku teh? Uh? The one the, that uh, has a very, very, very uh, milky, not milky. I mean, just uh, not not that brown. Good. Uh, in Singapore. So this is a fatty type. Just now I tried to like. All the rest are, are lean meat, so the best is always the fat, fatty one. Uh, of course, this is a lot of fat, which is good. So this uh, this bakute is very good with this tofu pot or some kind of tofu fried tofu like this. And um, huh? no, no. So the bakute is very 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 good. If, uh, the type of uh, Chinese uh, dough, fried dough that is called Yao Jiao Koi. Uh, but they don't have, normally around this time, lunch time, they won't have any more the Yao Jiao Koi because in the morning they have, but it will be finished by then. Put the one with the <coughs> with the fat. The lean ones are like not uh, not much taste to it. So fat is always the best. If you are uh, health conscious all the time, so you are shit out of luck. This tastes good with the fat. Yeah, so 
uh, Tonku Tonku uh, mushroom. Hey, what kind of uh, mushroom is this? A uh, mushroom, a Chinese mushroom is it? Tam chi. Tam chi. Tim. No, no, no. I mean this one, the brown one. Chinese, Chinese mushroom. Uh. I think that one is a uh, shiitake mushroom. Uh. Yeah. Looks like, looks like today we can actually finish the whole meat of the of the of the bowl there. Normally we have to tapa one, but this time is uh, we can finish it. So, I'm going to change my rating system uh, from today onwards. Only a bit left. Almost finished. Almost there. And I wonder if I can get get some extra soup from them or not. Whether they have any more soup. <laughs> So usually the meal will cost around 10 to 12 bucks a person. I think I to get a better deal for meeting this than to eat at the at those uh, very expensive uh, places like uh, like uh, uh, Nando's or whatnot. Or, uh, I, I uh, just came back from Paradigm. Of course, you can eat at the let's say Burger King. Uh, there's a set meal six ringgit burger, fries, and uh, soft drink. But uh, as you know, that's not so good, and also the burger is kind of small, uh, reflective of the price. It's only 6 ringgit, so we don't expect much. Do you get the feathers meat? So tomorrow I'll be going to Sarawak. Hopefully I'll find some very good food there. And my friend Jimmy is gonna like bring me around and he suggested eating another Baku Jai joint at the Jalan Klang Lama. So I'm not sure what he was referring to. So it'll be exciting to see uh, what difference is there in all the Baku Jai. But normally it's the same thing. It's the same old uh, recipe with herbs and spices. Same old shit. But this one, I just love the taste still. It's the last piece. Mm. 
So I'll show you the, the front facade of this place. So you can see there's an Indian temple there and LDP is there, the Motorola is there as well. Big site. I miss it. Ugly flats here. And this is Asam Baku there. A lot of people do come here to eat because uh, especially around uh, after uh, lunch time uh, a lot of uh, workers and you get to see a lot of uh, nice looking uh, office ladies of course and uh, well hopefully one day I get to see them how they actually do it uh, in terms of uh, not in terms of sex but in terms of uh, in the morning what, what kind of process did they do they definitely cook the uh, uh, excuse me yeah uh, uh, soup there in the morning and uh, of course you can see that there's a there's a vegetable as well there's a kai choy oh holy shit there should be a lot of uh, garlic and the taste uh, base of the baku there is actually garlic so let's take a look and this is the, the shop and the young chap there on the red there behind this white guy here is the one of the i think the tauke or something like that and uh, it's, a, it's a two shop lot the secret soup is there so today is a very very hazy day as well uh, so indonesia, indonesia is burning again again so so this is my third review of uh, Asang Baku Dam. So uh, as I said earlier, this is a change of rating system. Instead of using 5 as the maximum, I will be using 10. So I would say that this place would be a 9 out of 10. So it is really excellent. You have to come and try it. Of course, the Baku Dam is, uh, well, it depends on how you actually want to like it. But I really love it here. So 9 out of 10 is a very good score for a Baku Dam store. So see you in Malaysia and bye bye. Hey, maybe I can get some extra soup. Hey, Lusai, you have to go to the Yeah, Thank you. Uh. Hey, yeah, yeah, I can see how you can do your Oh, no, 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 Okay. So I think uh, so the soup is done at home so it's a secret so I can't actually uh, produce it uh, so uh, the, the best you can do is just come to this Asam Baku there and just have a nice time eating the excellent soup and uh, I agree with you that a lot of people really really like this uh, food here uh, unfortunately there's no more meat no more meat to accompany the soup so see you in Malaysia and bye bye. Remember this is a 9 out of 10 score. See you. You may jalan guy go. You may low ya. Huh? Thank you. So this is the Sungai Wei. Service tier that is. So yeah, do come here and eat it. So see you, Major, and bye-bye.